Get you updated on what's happening right now traffic wise. Ken's been telling us be prepared for the rain. Some areas already seeing some wet roads wherever you see the green highlighted here on our map means you could encounter some wet roads out there for the afternoon drive. That includes parts of 75 south of town. Also, of course, 40 west of the Knoxville area up on the plateau. So again, just kind of be careful. And of course, 75 north up around La Follette, Clinton. Some of those areas could be seeing some wet conditions right now. Real quick, let me show you what's happening with the TDOT Smartway camera. Still watching the cleanup of a few vehicles on the shoulder of the roadway, 75 south, right there at the 640 interchange. This is still causing some delay, so watch for that if you're coming back toward Knoxville on 75. 40 out near the way scales. Traffic there looking good, even though we do see some roads on the damp side. 40 over at Buttermilk and Loudoun County. Also a little on the wet side right now, but traffic moving along. Pellissippi Parkway traffic heavy, but looking good right now. 40 at Cherry, no problems. 40 at Gallagher View also right now rolling along for the afternoon drive. There are some drive times for you. 17 minutes, 40 east. I-140 to Asheville Highway, not bad. 3 minutes, 275 south, 640 to downtown. High winds shutting down a number of high elevation roads in Sevier County today. The Great Smoky Mountains National Parks sending out warnings this morning. Newfound Gap Road, Cades Cove Loop Road, along with part of Little River Road are closed today. And again, this is all due to high winds. Gabrielle